The marshal for the city of Monroe is being accused of sexually harassing a former marshal deputy. That former deputy says she was treated very unfairly because she's a woman. Fox 14's Isabel Albritton has been looking into this case, and she has more. Skylar Singleton was a deputy working for the Monroe City Marshal's Office for about two years. Singleton filed a charge with the Equal Employment Opportunity Commission, or EEOC, in April 2018 and sued Wentz Highshaw Jr. In court paperwork, Singleton accuses Highshaw of inappropriate comment. Quote, on one instance shortly after being hired, Highshaw commented on her bra size, remarking that it looked small. On another occasion around July 2017, former co-worker Heather Turner remarked how she and Singleton worked out together. Singleton also alleges Highshaw urged her and her other female coworker to come to his home to exercise. Quote, Marshall Highshaw replied that Singleton could come to his home to work out at around 4 a.m. and that Singleton would be welcome to bathe at his home afterwards. The lawsuit also alleges that Singleton was terminated without an explanation, but we reached out to Highshaw's attorney, Michael DuBose, who says Singleton was terminated during a budget cut and she was also not the only one who was cut. DeBose also said Singleton didn't raise any complaints during her employment. According to documents, Singleton said she refrained from complaining out of fear of losing her job. Another allegation in the lawsuit, Singleton says she and another female worker were told to decorate for a Thanksgiving party. She claims none of the male co-workers were asked to help. We reached out to Singleton's attorney, but they were not available to comment. A trial date has been set for August 10th.